Huskies came into the game, number 10 ranked team in the country, trying to get to 2 0 on the season. We'll start here on the first. Taylor Witt is going to kick it out to junior Josh Orman. He throws it up. That goes in. I had that as three points as he was shooting lights out all day long. And then Josh Orman here, he's going to drive, spin around a Michigan Tech defender, go up with it, get fouled. That goes in. That's worth three points as the Huskies go up big early. Then Taylor Witt, he's going to be down low here. And you see he's going to look for Matt Schneck. And Matt Schneck back door right here to Nate Phillips. He goes up with it, puts it in. He was a perfect 7 for 7 from the floor as the Huskies take a huge lead into halftime. And then Taylor Witt right here. He's been good last year. He's going to be good this year again. He drives to the lane, gets fouled, and puts it up. That's another three points for the Huskies. And then a couple plays later, Burnsetters is going to get the steal here. Witt's going to pick it up, throw it to Phillips, and then Phillips throws it to Burnsetter that puts it down. And the Huskies win this one 75-62. The Huskies had 12 steals in the game, and like I said, they win this one 75-62. to And with that win, the Huskies move to 2-0 on the season. And of that, of that 75 points they scored on Saturday night, 27 of them were off of turnovers. Matt Schneck recorded his second double-double of the season already with 14 points and 11 boards. And next up for the Huskies, they'll travel down to Sioux Falls for the NSIC Holiday Hoops Fest.